Hey everyone, this is Mukesh Jotwani once again from learnhyperinformation.com. Today in this video, we will be talking about how to uninstall Node.js in Mac operating system. There are two different ways how you can uninstall Node from Mac operating system. So before we start, let me quickly show you which version of Node which I'm running. So if I type Node space hyphen hyphen version, you will see currently at the time of recording, I'm using 20.14.0. You might be having a different version if you're watching this video later on. In a similar way, if I go ahead and check NPM version, again, I'm using 10.7.0. Now let's say I need to uninstall completely. So there are two different options. Option number one, how you can uninstall is using brew command. So when it comes to Node.js, there are two options to install, right? So if you go to official website, which is nodejs.org and if you go to download you can see first option is using package manager and the second option is using pre-built installer so by any chance if you have used package manager or homebrew you will be running this command okay so you will be typing brew uninstall node not node.js just say node and hit enter since i have installed in my system using a pre-built installer it is not able to find obviously and in your case if you have installed using brew it should remove it but by any chance if you have installed just like me you need to follow the approach which i'm going to talk about now so in case this works for you good to go but in case if you have installed using pre-built installer how to install pre-built uh, like how to install node.js using pre-built installer you just select the version which os you're using and which architecture so currently I have used this approach. So what happens whenever you use this installer, it goes to a specific location. So if you just run one command called where is node and hit enter. So you can see it gives me this location that in this particular location, I have all my nodes. So to show you this, I will sh first show you this directory. So this is user. This is my current user. And when you say dot, it's basically a hidden file. So let me show you directly this path. I will copy. And now I will be clicking on go, go to folder. And I will click on enter. So you can see this is the basically folder which we need to pay attention. Now, if you notice, here is the node. And right now I have two different versions. This is one which it was showing, right? And I have one more version. Now suppose I want to remove this completely. Now basically I can remove this folder. So how to remove this folder? Simply I don't have to go back to each and every file and directory. What I can do, I can directly delete this directory. So to delete this, what I will do, I will say rm which is remove hyphen rf which is recursive forcefully and then I will give this path. The moment I hit enter, Okay, so since I'm not running through a admin, right? So you can see permission denied, permission denied, permission denied. So what you can do, you just clear it and type sudo rm minus rf and give this directory. In your case, the user will change obviously, but the path will remain same. And in order to cross check as I just did, you have to go and see. The moment I hit enter now, it is asking my system password. So I will just enter the password here. Okay, so basically it has deleted now. So what I will do if I just go ahead and check node space hyphen hyphen version, it says command not found. So it is not able to find node. It means it has uninstalled. So what we did, we basically find out the location where exactly is my node is available. I remove this complete directory. Now sometimes uh, even after doing this, if you still have uh, you're still able to see the node version then you need to follow a different approach so this approach is basically what we deleted is we deleted the directory now node.js also comes as a binary so what you have to do again you have to go back and now you have to look for a folder called usr okay so just type usr under usr you will find local and here you can see we have include many times if you see node here please delete the node folder right now in my case i don't have but in your case if you have here please delete the directory and if i go back to my bin folder 
you can see these are the binaries right npx is available here by any chance if you have node here please delete that as well fine and on safer side what you can do check in bin do you have a node or node modules you can quickly check in the include as well you can also check in the library as well generally you will find here as well but if you don't have we are good to go but by any chance if you have node or node modules here please delete that as well in my case by just deleting the directory it has uninstalled so if I type once again npm space hyphen hyphen version it's not available so try this let me know if you face any issues and I will see you in the next video till then bye bye take care